My name is Fiorella Barco. My first name is Karen. So my second name is Fiorella. Everybody knows me like Fio. That is my nickname. So I'm from Peru. I'm especially from the city of Arequipa that is in the south of Peru. It's a special city. In Peru, um, for 10 years, I used to own two restaurants. So, but the situation there started to be really hard. It's people who used to give you money, force you to, to borrow money, but you have to pay like 20% more. So, and I was in a really high risk there. So one day I decided to sell my restaurant for nothing, a really cheap price, to pay everything, but to sleep good. So I wanted to sleep because I couldn't sleep for, for a year. So we lose everything. So our life reduced, you know, in a suitcase. But all that situation made me to come back to God. You know, so everything was writing that I used to lose everything to come here, but I met God here again. That is that is the the most important thing. It's like I recognized that He was my Lord, and He was doing everything that happened to me was because I was far away from. From him. So I asked him for my asylum here for me and her. So we are working on those things because it's really hard the situation. Actually, in my country, it's really, really hard. So it's, there's no possibilities that I go back there. So I was at the, um, I was working hard uh, in my work in Old Marco. I told my boss about my situation in that moment that I was looking for a place that is hard because I don't have credit, you know, I didn't have uh, money, I was just looking. So I was in a hard situation and she told me, like, are you praying? So you need to do that, you need to be close to God and don't worry. So somebody will do something for you. So don't worry, you will find a place, you will find the resources. So it's like, don't worry. One day I was working and she called me to the office and there was Jerry and that's why he introduced me to Jerry. And the next day I was super connected with the church. I can go to the church or somebody from the church and they will hug me and take care of me. I feel protected. So. God put the church, put people, put angels around me, so to protect me, to take care of me and Sally all the time. So I have a lot of angels around me and I know they are God angels. So and for me now it's very special. So to share that, you know, that's why uh, we are doing that things to serving other people because God did many things to me. They are big or they are small things, so maybe I don't have you know the money to give it to them. But He gave me people, and through people we are doing that.